Hey guys, so today I'll be showing you how to download like a data set for your area of interest completely free of cost. So first what you need to do is you have to go to the USGS Web Explorer website uh, and once you have logged in with your username and password you'll be seeing a window like this. Here you can input your area of interest below the address place option and if the website gives you multiple options you can select the right area from here. So my area of study is Hoffman Forest in North Carolina and you can see that it's marked red in the map. If you have more than one study site you'll be seeing that in order 1, 2, 3 on them. As I am pretty aware that there was a related data collection happened in the year 2014 here in my search criteria, I am giving the years 2013 till 2016. Apart from giving your exact address of your study site, you can also select the area of interest using the pattern row option and the feature option. So once you have selected your study area and the time period for which you want the letter, then you can go to the next section that is a data set. Here in the data set search window, you can just type in later and then it will automatically give you an option for selecting later. Once that's done, you have also options for additional criteria, but here I won't be doing that, I'll be just going directly to my results. And here I have my later data file. If your study site have more than one later data collection happen over the years, here you'll be seeing more than one option. So here you can see all the details regarding the image. Now either you can export it using the click here to export your results option. Here you have options for shapefile and CSVs. But sometimes shapefiles might be too large for ArcMap to handle. So here also you have other option for downloading it as last dataset which is a traditional way of downloading later data files. You just need to click download here and that's it. There are also several other useful websites which gives you access to free later resources. I have listed them in the description section. And also, I have created another video on how to visualize your latest data set and then export it into ArcMap. If you're interested, please click on the link on the right side so that you can have a look at that video. Thank you guys for watching my video and if you have any question regarding this video please mention that in the comment section and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. So till next time bye bye.